a female grizzly bear with my cub. I bought some tuna I got from a grocery store. I think my cub loves the tuna. Yeah, mom, the, the tuna is absolutely delicious. And you got sardines and tuna. Delicious. I love fish. I am a brown bear, also called grizzly bear. A grizzly bear's closest relative is a polar bear. I got some sweet honeycombs that I think I'll love. I stole them from a beehive. I almost got stung to death by angry bees. I also took the bee larva, but I ate it. Do you want the honey, Cub? Oh my, yeah. I want the honey. Let's see what it tastes like. Mm, it's good, but it doesn't taste as good as the fish or tuna. Ooh, are those flowers? Ooh, those are berries. I'm up in a tree so I can hide this honey. I don't want no other bear trying to steal the honey. I also got some fruit, some flowers. Are those termites? Well, I'm not a sloth bear. I want that honey, babe. Get it from her. We're sun bears. We're like the smallest bear species. Grizzly bears are large. I still want the honey. We are the bear that loves the honey the most. We've even been called sun bears. We are the smallest species of bear. Yeah, we weigh as much as a dog. And if we were to try to steal the grizzly bear's honey, plus she has her cubs, look. I don't give a freak. Just get the honey. I really, really want the honey. Really? Uh, can I get your honey? Um, no, you're not getting my honey. This is for me and my cub. Uh, she said no. Uh, just steal it from her. Just steal it from her. When her and her cub are asleep, don't worry. We'll steal it. Um, excuse me, you're not gonna steal anything. I'm protecting my honeycombs. Me and my cub are gonna eat it, not you. Plus, you're the smallest bear species. A sun bear can't compete with a full-grown female or male grizzly. Grizzly bears are ten times the size of sun bears. Mm. Honey is so delicious. But I really, really want the honey. You have vegetation right there. Just eat the vegetation. Whatever. <sighs> you know what? Just get out of here. I know what I'll do. I'll just steal the honeycombs while they are asleep or when they go to hunt for food. Because bears are omnivores. That means they eat both plants and meat. Oh, are those insects I can eat? Ooh. Are those termites and ants? Mmm, they're pretty good. Is this a walnut? Ooh, let me take off my hat. Time to take a bite. Mmm. I took a large bite out of it. Mmm. The walnut tastes delicious. Hey, why are you eating my fruit? Um, I suggest you get out of my territory. Unless you want to die. Yeah, babe, I think we should leave and go into our own territory. I'm going into a cave. No, I'll just climb a tree. Ugh. Babe, come on. Uh, I'm coming. Let me bit my hat, put my hat back on. I gotta climb the tree. Yeah, that's what I thought. Scurry up the tree. Because do not come back. Me and my cub are trying to enjoy this beautiful day. There's no interference. We're just trying to eat our flowers, eat our berries, and eat our honey in peace. So please leave us alone, you sun bears. Ugh, climb back on the tree. Uh, I'm going to eat some of the tuna. Mm, it's absolutely delicious. Mm, 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 mm. Yeah, Mom, it's so delicious. And I stole some bird eggs. I have some apples. And yeah. Hello, this is deep in the sea. I might look like a penguin. Puffins are not related to penguins. We're black and white. We're actually part of the auk family. There was an extinct member of flightless birds. 
called the Great Auk, and they kind of looked like penguins. Not only were they not only were they black and white, they also couldn't fly like today's penguins, but puffins can fly. Same with flamingos. Flamingos get their pink coloration because of what they eat. Since we eat since we eat both plants and meat, flamingos are omnivores. Flamingos mostly eat, eat shrimp, crustaceans, fish, mollusk, and other food types. Uh, I'm a seal on ice. I'm a fur seal. I hope there's no sharks or orcas. I'm a krill. Krill are tiny crustaceans. We are mainly eaten by leopard seals, penguins, and blue whales, and humpback whales. <sighs> I'm a harp seal. Ooh, is that coral? Is that abalone? Abalone. Abalone. We're also related to gulls, also called seagulls. Seagulls are crazy birds because they will eat anything. They'll eat garbage, plastic, metal, anything you might throw away. Yeah, they're crazy. <laughs> True. Also, you might didn't know this. Yeah, baby flamingos aren't born pink. They get their pink coloration because of the food they eat. Flamingo chicks are born white or gray. And we feed our baby this this um, substance called crop milk. It's red in color. No, it is not blood. And we feed it to our chick. Oh, yeah, that sounds nice. I need to go hunt for a fish. Time to jump back into the water. Time to jump in the water. Time to go hunt for fish. Where is there some fish at? Oh, is that krill? Well, leopards don't, I mean, well, not, well, not leopards. Well, seals don't really eat krill. Only leopard seals eat krill. Leopard seals also eat other pinnipeds. Pinnipeds means thin-footed in Latin. Pinnipeds are walruses, fur seals, leopard seals, harbor seals, harp seals, and other seals. Seals are closely related to bears. Ugh, where's some fish at? Please don't eat me. I'm not gonna eat you. Oh, I see a fish. No, it's not a fish, it's a bird. Oh, oh my gosh, oh my gosh, is that a seal? Ow! Seals have sharp teeth. Ow! 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 Seals are mainly preyed upon by large predators, including great white sharks, orcas, and other predators. Also, seals are preyed upon by polar bears who wait for the seals to come up on ice to breathe because seals can't stay, stay submerged underwater for very, for very long periods. Seals have to come up on shore to breathe. So the predators wait. And orcas even create ice flows to knock seals off of, create um, waves to knock ice to knock, to knock seals off ice flows. So basically the orcas cr create waves to, to knock seals off ice flows. Some orcas even beach themselves to snag other mammals right off the shore. Orcas are basically giant black and white dolphins. Although their name, although their name has whale Orcas are not related to whales at all. They're not cetaceans. Orcas are the biggest of the dolphins, and they can rival even the most fearsome predators like great white sharks. Because in movies, it's always the great white shark that is the ultimate apex predator. Nobody messes with great white sharks. But orcas actually have the balls to mess with great white sharks. Orcas have also been up observed tearing out the livers of great white sharks orcas only eat the livers of great white sharks kind of like how polar bears only eat the blubber of seals also orcas orcas eat penguins seals and 
fish, seabirds, and more. They can even hunt the biggest, biggest animal, the blue whale. Although, as you can see, the sheer size of the blue whale is enough to overpower a single orca and even an entire pod of orcas. But there's one thing the blue whale doesn't have. Teeth. Blue whales don't have teeth. They lack teeth. Instead, they have baleen or baleen plates. So they're filter feeders. So they suck up water. And then they catch our prey. Blue whales mostly eat fish, crustaceans, and krill. They're the largest animals. Their tongue can weigh as much as a can weigh as much as an adult elephant. So I'm just gonna eat this bird. Mm. It's absolutely delicious. Well, I'm just gonna fly to look for food, Mother. I'll be right back. Okay. Puffins can fly, unlike penguins. Uh, is that an antelope? Where can I find some prey? Ooh, are those insects? It looks like they already have been eaten by a predator. Mother, mother, I couldn't find any fish. Well, that's a shame. It looks like you won't be eating. I'm gonna go find some food as well. There's like, the biggest flamingo is the greater flamingo, while the smallest is the James flamingo. Flamingos have long legs. We, are, we have a pink color. We have large wings. And unlike other waterfowl, we can fly. I'm not even sure if flamingos are waterfowl, but they're water birds. Uh, mm. This bird's blubber is so delicious. Although, you need to know something about walruses. So, a walrus's ancestor didn't have tusks. So, our, so walruses weren't equipped with tusks. And the, the walrus's ancestor kind of resembled the modern otter. You know otters, the giant river otters in particular? Otters are these semi-aquatic mammals that eat fish. They're related to weasels. They're related to martens. They're related to honey badgers and wolverines. They're called mustelids. Mm. Mm. Ooh, is that a seal? It's eating a bird. Okay, the seal doesn't see me. I need to be agile. Oh, oh my gosh! Oh, oh my gosh! Oh, oh my gosh! Oh. I knew my death was coming for me. Uh, it's time to start digging in your blubber. Uh, please. Uh, no. Ow, your paw swipe. Mm. Mm. Mm, so delicious. Mm. Mm. The meat. Oh my gosh, did that polar bear just kill that poor seal or fur seal? Mm, mm. This seal blubber is delicious. Mm. Polar bears are apex predators, and unlike any other bear species, which are omnivores, polar bears are exclusively meat eaters or carnivores. Other bears are omnivores, which means they eat both plants and meat. So unlike any other bear, which are omnivores, as they eat both plants and meat, polar bears are meat eaters and eat almost exclusively meat. Like how giant pandas eat almost exclusively vegetation or plants. Polar bears eat ringed seals, but we might also eat bearded seals. We also eat the carcasses of dead animals like whales. We also hunt beluga whales. Mm, mm. We also hunt walruses when they're on land because a fight between a walrus and a polar bear can go either way. But if it's on land, the polar bear definitely wins. But if it's in the water, the walrus would defeat 
the polar bear. Polar bears are good swimmers, better than better than most Olympic swimmers. We can swim fast too. Also, for a polar bear, you don't have any survival. Like, if you see a polar bear, you can't spray bear spray. You can't get on the ground. You can't make yourself seem bigger. You can't wave your arms around. The polar bear is going to get you no matter what you do. With a brown bear, get down on the ground. With a black bear, make yourself look bigger. And with a polar bear, say goodbye to life because you're going to die. Mm. Mm. I never witnessed such horrifying scenes. Why does it look like a wave is gonna come? What wave is gonna come? Oh my god, is that a blue or a humpback whale? Oh my gosh, it jumped out of the water. Oh my gosh, it's trying to eat me. Ooh, is that krill? I love krill. Mmm. Mmm, krill is so delicious. Krill or crustaceans. They might look like shrimp, but they're not shrimp at all. They have antennas. Mm. Mm. Mm, mm, mm. That krill was absolutely magnificent. Now I'm going to jump back into the water. <laughs> Whales have naturally no predators because of their size, but orcas and great white sharks might may attack humpback whales, but they only attack young or sick humpback whales. Also, orcas can't kill blue whales. They can only kill juvenile blue whales because of their smaller size. But an adult blue whale could kill an orca if it slapped the orca with its tail. Whales have powerful tails. We have fluke tails that help us swim. Also, whales are related to porpoises and dolphins. Dolphins and porpoises are basically small whales or small cetaceans. So, whales, dolphins, and porpoises, we are all cetaceans. Also, hippos are cetaceans, too. Wait, I didn't know hippos. I thought hippos were related to pigs. Hippos are not related to pigs. Hippos are more related to something like a giraffe rather than a pig. DNA shows that hippos and pigs aren't even that closely related. Hippos are actually related to whales, although they have an ancient word that means river horse, although they have a name that means river horse. But hippos and horses aren't closely related at all. Well, I'll go find you some fish, honey. Ugh. Okay, Mom, I'm coming. And a lone sperm whale would kill an orca in a one on one fight. Mmm, so delicious. Not even polar bears can kill whales. Oh, excuse me? <laughs> yeah, you can't kill whales. If I wanted to, I would. Whales are just too big for any predator. That includes sharks. Not even orcas can kill a blue whale or a humpback whale. Orcas only can hunt. Orcas can only kill great white sharks, saltwater crocodiles, and other predators. Not only are orcas much bigger than great white sharks, orcas are also smarter smarter than great white sharks. Even female orcas have no problem taking down a larger great white shark that got too close to the orca's calf. That's what baby orcas are called, calves. Hunting techniques are passed down from mother orcas to their babies. Oh. Mmm. Hello, I am an antelope. Antelope. I am a springbok, a springbok antelope. I'm not a gazelle or an impala. Is that an anaconda? Anacondas are the largest snake in the Amazon River Basin. They live in Brazil and other, they live in South America. They have no food rivals, although they do compete with jaguars and caimans. 
Anacondas hunt larger prey like caimans, jaguars, capybara, tapir, deer, and other and other um, animals. Juveniles tend to take birds, fish, and small mammals. Adults are able to kill much larger prey. Females are some, will sometimes cannibalize males, especially during the breeding season. Because female anacondas are larger than males. Ooh. Anacondas are, are an olive green color. We have spots. We are the biggest snake. But there is a snake that is longer than an anaconda. But the girth of the anaconda make, makes it almost as big. The reticulated python is longer than the anaconda. Ooh, should I kill this antelope? This antelope looks tasty and nice and plump. Oh, oh my gosh! Anacondas don't have venom, so we constrict our prey. We kill our prey by constriction. Oh my gosh! We squeeze tighter and tighter. Many people think this is intended to break bones, but no, it's actually intended to break, not to break bones. It's intended to cut off blood vessels or blood circulation. A python or an anaconda can tell when to let go because they can hear the they can hear the heart of their prey. Please let go of me. <laughs> It's time to eat my meal head first. Uh, 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 uh. Mm, that was a nice meal. I'm going to be stuffed after that. <sighs> also, many people think boas and pythons are related, but there's a clear-cut difference. Pythons, I mean, anacondas thrive in water. In fact, their scientific name means good swimmer. Pythons are, some pythons are arboreal. Some pythons travel on land. Anacondas are slow on land, but they are surprisingly fast in the water. We can even kill crocodiles and caimans, but we hunt caimans, which are much smaller than crocodiles. A full-grown crocodile would beat an anaconda in a fight. An anaconda would struggle to rip not to rip to um an anaconda would struggle to wrap its entire body around a crocodile to in, to inhibit its movement and crush it so basically an anaconda can't kill a full grown crocodile we can only hunt caimans and other smaller crocodilians i'm going to slither away <laughs> I'm going to go steal the honey. Oh my gosh, they're sleeping. They're asleep. Ugh. Huh? Oh my gosh, I knocked the honey. I didn't mean to. Let me take my hat off. Ooh, honey. Are you eating my honey? <coughs> Ow. Get out of my honey. Ow. Give me my honey. Ow. What are you doing? Get off of me. Why are you eating my honey? I'm sorry. I just wanted a little bit. I just wanted a tasty bit of your honeycomb. <coughs> Ow! <laughs> Give me this honey. I want some. It's my honey. It's not your honey. Mm. I'm going to eat it. Not you. Give me some. Give me some. Give me. What are you doing? I want some honeycomb. Are you serious? Ow! Ow! You dropped something! Ow! 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 Ah! Ah! Ow! Get off of me! Mom, what is going on? Oh, mother, what are you doing? Uh, 
<laughs> I'm getting rid of this thief. She or he was trying to steal our honeycombs. Uh, please stop biting me. Uh, 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 uh. What's going on? Oh, oh my gosh, it's you. <laughs> Ow! I'm gonna kill you and your wife. Ow! Ow! Uh, get out of here, I'm out. Help me! Brown bears can climb trees, too. Ow! Uh, ow! Uh, ow! Get off of him! Uh, you're the smallest living bear. all this weight. Grit, a male grizzly can weigh 600 pounds uh, or more than that. Uh, ow! Ah. Time to kill you with one paw swipe. No! <laughs> ow! Ow! I'm trying to protect my cubs. Get off of him! My neck! You're suffocating! Get off of me! How dare you! Please! Get off of me! I'm a sun bear! Get off of me! I'm out of here! I'm climbing a tree! You're biting me on the back of my head. Uh, uh, oh my gosh. Get off of her. Uh, you get off of me. Uh, ow, my neck. Ow. No. No. I'm out of here. She's killing him. I can see. Uh, get off of it. Get off. Uh, uh, just die already. Uh, no, he's, she's going to kill me next. She's going to kill me. What's going on? Oh, I'm just relaxing. No. No. Oh, oh, help me. Get off of me. Uh, how dare you? Time to kill you with my paw swipe. No, you won't. Ow! You're not gonna kill anyone. Just die. Mother, stop! Ow! Ow! Stop killing us. Stop killing them. They're bears like us. They're trying to steal our honey. There's no need to kill someone. Just give them one honeycomb. It's not that big of a deal. I want to keep the honey all to myself. He's right. Sharing is caring. And you almost killed my fiance. Ugh. Ugh. Fine. Here. And you better not ask for any more honeycombs. There. Are you happy? Yay! Huh. Ugh. I got some honey. You want some? I got some honey. Mmm. So delicious. I got honey. Do you want some honey? Uh, no, I don't want honey. I'm scarred. That female grizzly bear, she weighed a ton. She almost killed me. I'm sorry. I need to I need to handle my anger issues. I was just doing it in self-defense. I thought you were gonna try to eat my cub. We would never do that. We are sweet and naive. We would never do that. I'm sorry. I went over the top. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm really sorry. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to be that mean. We forgive you, but my fiance is probably going to be scarred for the rest of his life. Come on. Let's climb the tree. Ugh. Okay. Whatever you say. Um, I'm sorry again. 
Mom, see, sharing is caring. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, Henry or Haribu. Which which name do you like? Do you like Haribu or Henry? I want to be named that. I want to be named Haribu because that's the gummy bear's name. Okay, Haribu. So basically, nothing can kill a whale. Something can kill a whale. Plus, also, you shouldn't be worried about getting swallowed by a whale. It's impossible. You shouldn't be worried about getting swallowed by a sperm whale. Because sperm whales have teeth. Unlike blue whales who have baleen or baleen. So, you, first, you would be shredded by the sperm whale's teeth. You might see a bio, biolucent squid in the squid's mouth. I mean, in the whale's mouth. You might see a bio biolucent squid. Oh. <sighs> I need to go hunt for food. I just need to relax for a second. We all need to, re to relax. Today is such a beautiful day. I know it's such a beautiful day. Yeah, true. It's too bad we haven't caught any crustaceans or any fish. Today isn't our lucky day, isn't it? Yeah, today isn't our lucky day. We're just going to relax. I hope you guys liked that film. It was a short film. Also, I'm noticing... I'm always wearing white t-shirts. I don't know why. <laughs> but I need to wear something with a little color. Anyways, I hope you guys like that film. I got inspired to make this film because I was just searching on Google. I was like, because I love nature. I was like, who would win a fight between a sloth bear and a sun bear? And of course it said, a sloth bear would win a fight against a sun bear. It is heavier, larger. And it said a fight might break out if a tasty honeycomb honeycomb fell out of the tree or one of the bears a fight might break out if one of the bears one of the bears knocked a honeycomb out of the tree so i decided to make a film about a female bear with her cubs she is being terrorized by sun bears who want to steal her honey but she, she doesn't let them get the honeycomb until the end when her cub encourages her that sharing is caring you should always follow that rule I'm just kidding. I never share. I keep all my cookies and all of my snacks to myself.